Welcome back to Forza Horizon 5, where yesterday we checked out this thing, the Neo EP9. One of the things I said in that video, though, was that today we would go in and unlock another new vehicle. When I say unlock, I actually mean spend spend money on this is the 2010 porsche 911 sport classic if you ask me this is one of the best looking porsche 911s ever made bone stock it's rear wheel drive got 400 horsepower 300 foot pounds of torque before we get into any fh5 customization we'll drive this thing bone stock see what it's like and then we'll come back to the festival and give it a go this wouldn't be an ar12 video without any fun facts about the Porsche 911 Sport Classic. For those of you who don't know, this is a very, very rare Porsche 911 that was only made for one year. They plan to make 250 of them for the entire world, and these were the most expensive Porsche 911s of the time. Just for reference, a GT3 RS at the time was like 150,000 euros, I think. This was 180,000 euros, so it was a lot of money. Saying that though, all of them, all 250, sold in 48 hours of them getting an ounce. However, if you did buy one of them, boy, you've done really, really well. The most recent one I could find of these that actually sold, sold in 2019 for nearly 700 thousand dollars saying that i hate this car let me pause and let me take you back in time back in forza motorsport 3 they had dlc packs that came out every single month one of those car packs was the jalopnik car pack the jalopnik car pack included a whole bunch of cars including the Porsche 911 Sport Classic. You might be saying, well, that that's that's not so bad, Nick. Cars are in car packs all the time, and that's true. Fast forward in time to Forza Motorsport 4, there was another DLC, this time the Porsche Expansion Pack, and that included, you guessed it, the Porsche 911 Sport Class. Fast forward again to Forza Horizon 5, and it's now in the car pass, and you need to pay for it for a third time. We've had to buy this car three times for DLC. Again, saying that, I, 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 I really like this car. Ever since it came out, I have loved this vehicle and I don't know what it is about it, but it's so goddamn cool. We're actually sitting in the middle of A-class bone stock, which is actually a nice place to be. We're gonna do a whole bunch of builds with this thing, but let's start it off with an A-class road build. I feel like can be good. Engine swaps available for this thing. We've got a 3.8 liter. We can upgrade it to a flat six twin turbo 3.8. That's out of a GT2 RS, isn't it? That GT2 RS engine is so sick, but unfortunately it makes us go up into S1 class. So we'll save that engine. We'll come back to it in one second. We can make this thing all wheel drive. Again, we'll come back to that in a second. We can go and make it twin turbo. That's not bad. Aero, we can get on the vehicle. We can swap on a front splitter on there. That's not bad. Again, we'll come back to that when we do our try hardy. Oh. Oh, hello. I was expecting like a nasty rear wing kind of on top of the rear wing, but that that's that's nice. We can also go in here and swap our tires and rims. So bone stock, we are on sport tires by the looks of it. We can get semi slick tires, full slick tires, even off road. Those actually look kind of good. I kind of love the idea of a go anywhere, do anything Porsche 911. We will come back to those for sure. Rims, honestly, I I, I don't want to swap the rims. I, I love the rims on this thing. So we're not going to mess with them. Gives it a tiny, tiny little bit of poke. So I'll go for that. Anyways, we'll go for a race transmission, which is a six speed gearbox. Okay, perfect. We will keep that. After that, we can do our suspension. We can get sports suspension. Race suspension actually looks really good. That fitment just looks incredible. Drift suspension looks really good as well. Rally suspension again. We will come back to that. We can also get some weight reduction on here, actually. We can bring it down to 2,700 pounds on here, which is actually really good. You know what, though? I think I'm going to go for some sport weight reduction on this thing. 
and then just get a little bit of horsepower on it. After all of our upgrades, we've got nearly 500 horsepower. We weigh 3,000 pounds exactly. And we've got nicer, grippier tires and better suspension to hopefully make us go around the corners. Wheelie build? I'm not sure if it'll do a wheelie. We can try. Twitch chat's really saying it's basically a Volkswagen Beetle. Of course it can do a wheelie. I'm not sure if we actually want to paint this thing because we've got these really nice subtle stripes that go all the way over it, but we can recreate those ourselves. I did it. 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 That looks sick. That looks so sick. That looks so goddamn sick. There you go. If you want to download it, feel free. Enjoy my blue stripes. Stripey boy. Please be half as good as it looks, okay? And it's not, not, not a, no, not a good start. Why is the game trying to do me dirty instantly? Porsche 911 Sport Classic in our blue classic paint job. Away we go. So we're A class, rear wheel drive with like 500 horsepower. Although it might not be the fastest car I've ever made, I think this might be. One of the best cars I've ever made. So let's go. Send it into some of these corners. Look at that. Turn in. Our suspension is allowing us to turn in beautifully. And those thick, thick tires are just propelling us through the corner. Smooth operator. It drives like a dream. It, it's it's a, a, his best car. Best car I've ever made. There's no question about it. Screw it. Make me buy it five times. I'll still buy this car. It's that goddamn cool. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I, I love it. I love it. I, I've done one build and I've been driving it for all of five minutes max. It's so good in the corners. It's got 500 horsepower so you don't feel like a slouch. It's got super thick and grippy tires so you're not spinning your wheels constantly. And then it's got rear wheel drive so if you want to come into the corner and have a little bit of fun, you can. I don't think it gets much better than that. Wait, 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 wait. If we are going to crank this up a little bit. Why don't we try to make it an off-road car? Porsche has rally DNA. For those of you who don't know, Porsche used to rally drive a bunch of older 911s. So why can't we do it with this one? It's a video game. We can do what we want. So let's swap the engine, GT2 RS engine in here, and some all-wheel drive. That is beautiful at the bottom of S1 class. That's going to allow me to properly crank this up with a front splitter. Thank you very much. And with a rear wing or a little rear lip on our ducktail. Then we're going to need some off-road race tires because those look sick. Ooh, and you know what else? I can now go for full weight reduction. Remove another 300 pounds out of it. Unfortunately, now we've got all-wheel drive, so we're still going to be a little bit on the heavy side, but not bad. After all of our upgrades, no joke, with every single power upgrade applied, top of S1 class perfectly. 1,100 horsepower, 3,000 pounds. Beautiful. Beautiful car already. What does that say? Fire. What did you write on the side of your vehicle? <laughs> In before fire gets banned. This is what I'm talking about. This is a proper looking race car now. Our wannabe rally car. Against some very wannabe rally car. Whoa. Whoa, my gears. Whoa, my gears are full on proper rally to- Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. I cannot drive it like that. I'm sorry. Dune. Just- Nothing to see. We cannot do our Porsche 911 Sport Classic dirty. I love this car. We need to treat it properly. Away we go. Come on, buddy. There we go. Reel him in. Reel him in. This car is unreal quick off the line. That's crazy. Yo, we're flying. We're flying. Who needs a desert flyer when you've got a Sport Classic? Whoa. Whoa. I think fixing our gears was definitely the right call. We would have missed out on something so special. I'm definitely going to be a little bit sus on the road with my off-road race tires. So, yeah, I, 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 I have no performance on the road. None at all. Oh, yeah, none, 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 nothing. Wow. This thing's sick. I think you can see why I like this car so much now. This thing's awesome. It's just, 
It's so good. Here we go. Got him. Got him. Oh, sorry. I put my car into a wall. Look at me go. Uh-oh. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Got him. We're good. Let's go for the desert flyers. Yo, look at the lap time as well. We killed that one. Since we've got all of this horsepower on here right now, should we give it a go for a wheelie? We're just gonna need to swap some drag tires on and... Yeah, I'm a man of the people. I do what the people want. Drag tires. Thank you very much. We're also going to reduce our tire size in the front to make us a little bit lighter. And we're even going to go as try hard as getting some lightweight rims. You know what? We're also probably going to want to be rear wheel drive. Basically, all of the weight is in the back now. I don't think this is going to work. No way. Oh, for God's sake. Really? Really? I mean, wheelie? <laughs> rev, rev, rev it up. And I'm about to prove myself very wrong. God damn it. I didn't think that would work. I mean, it's not the biggest wheelies ever because the back is so close to the ground already, but it works. How does this work? Oh, it must be part Mustang. Anyways, moving on back to the festival. All right, all of Twitch chat wants me to drift it to try to find something this can't do, but I'm just gonna make it rear wheel drive. We're gonna go for a very basic drift car. We're gonna keep the stock engine in, keep it rear wheel drive. Uh, I'm not even gonna twin turbo it. I'm just gonna keep it naturally aspirated. No arrow onto this thing. All we're gonna do for our tires is toss on drift tires. After all of our upgrades this time, rear wheel drive weighs 2,600 pounds and 669 horsepower. Very nice. Some of these smaller drift zones, could probably do well. 110,000 here in the jungle for three stars. My personal best is nearly 200,000. This actually feels like a legit drift car now. You need to, you need to send it properly through here because it's, it's actually fairly underpowered to some of the cars I've been driving before to set all of these scores. You've got to treat it nicely, I guess would be the right word for it. Let's go. Come on. Let's see what score we can get up here though. I think I'm probably going to have to go the other direction because it just, it doesn't really have that much horsepower to spin the wheels and head all the way up the mountain. Come on. 140,000. No way. 150, 160. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No way. Whoa, no way. No way. That there's, there's, there is nothing that this car cannot do. Absolutely not. I'm going to another one. No, no, I need another one. This is another small little drift zone. Personal best, 184,000. 184,000 is the score I need to get. Come on. Send it through corner one. Wow, I'm going to need to send it so fast through corner one to make that all in one. I can definitely clean that up as well if I have a little bit more speed. I just, I need a little bit more speed and then this is going to be even easier. Look at it go though. It's just, it's a beautiful car to drift around. 100,000. Well, I need way more speed. I'll do another attempt from the other direction. And I think that'll be better. Whoa, no way. Even on that shocking attempt, I nearly did it. Go, go. Go, 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 go. This way feels better. This direction feels much better for this zone. There's 100,000. Keep it on the road. Nice, nice, nice. 110. This is going to be it. This is it. This is it. This is it. This is it. 140. 150. 60. 70. Yes! Make it two for two with the Sport Classic. What a beast is this? The fastest car in the game? No. Is it the best drift car in the game? No. But is it one of the best cars in the game? Yeah. Yeah, it is. <laughs>